Mock Plus is a great all-in-one tool for planning, designing and developing beautiful apps or web pages. But it is also very versatile. If you use Sketch, Figma, XD, Photoshop or Axia, we have plugins for all of these. So even if you design in other apps, you can still gain huge collaborative or development benefits from using Mock Plus. In this video, I'm going to use Sketch together with Mock Plus to edit a really awesome design by collaborating with my team in Mock Plus. So this is an example app, Greener, an app for houseplants and just general green living. And I'm just going to go up here and choose the Mock Plus plugin so I can just export everything to Mock Plus. I can choose the artboard resolution or different systems and I can choose to upload single pages or in my case, I'm just going to upload everything. Now let's go over to Mot Plus. Here we can see the whole storyboard. You can add logic lines between pages and add comments to your logic lines. So I'm happy. This looks good. I've got a good overview of my app and how all the pages jump from one to the other. Now I'm going to go into a page and check if I've got any comments or see if there's anything I want to mark up. Actually, on second glance, I may want to change the position of the shop tab. So I'm just going to comment here and ask my designer to change it. And now I'll just go over some comments from my team. There, that looks better. And it's great. Over here, anyone in your team can go over your revision histories and then compare versions. Either with a split, a fade, a slide, or even a negative comparison, so you can see the difference very clearly. So now I'm going to go and be the developer and review the design. I could do a coordinate markup, a spacing markup between anything in the design, a regional markup to find out the exact size of the area, A colour markup, so I know the exact hex code for a colour in the design. Or I can simply add a comment to anyone in my team. And now I can go over to the develop section. I'm going to choose the browse text field. And down here, I can easily copy the code of the asset in Objective-C. Here, it's really easy to change quickly between code languages because all codes are automatically generated in the background as you design. So I can easily switch between iOS, Android or CSS. And again, here with the profile picture, there are a multitude of options. and I can download the asset here. Now I can add interactions between pages 
choose the target and trigger along with transitions and animations. And then try out the prototype. Nice!